we are doing here is uh, something called brain inspired computation. Now that may sound cryptic, but think of it this way. Uh, if you have to add 5 plus 5, you know it is 10. But if I ask you to add 1,2055 plus blah, 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 you would not do that in your head. You would take out a calculator and just do it. That's simple. So computer wins over our human brain. But if there is a person in the crowd or uh, who is your friend, it's a completely big crowd, but you can still see, ah, that's Dave or that's, I don't know, someone. Or if there is a voice of your friend in a club, you can still recognize that voice, that, ah, that's my friend's voice. But if you give the same task to the same computer, the computer will not do it that well. And it needs supercomputer with megawatts of power. And so there is something very fundamental which our brain does much better. And the need of the hour is to actually do the computation, at least a part of the computation, this pattern recognition, the way the brain does. And that's what we are trying to do. So uh, our idea is to actually create those brain-like networks on actually physical chips and then utilize them to do pattern recognition. Over the world, whether it will be HP, IBM, Qualcomm, Samsung, everybody is investing billions of dollars in this brain-like re uh, computing research. And this is our attempt in New Zealand to get to that stage and be a, a leader in a very niche market. So we are very excited about what has come out of the project and what we are looking forward into the future. So we are very excited.